welcome back to the bookworms, buddy. It is time for another Let's Talk Authors, and this week I've decided to talk about James Patterson. Uh, James Patterson has a huge empire. Um, he's got lots of people he co-writes with. He's got series. He's got standalones. Um, he's got mystery. He's got love stories. He's got contemporaries. Um, he's got young adult. He's got his hand in a lot of different plates when it comes to writing. Um, the series that I'm most aware of is uh, his Women's Murder Club and also the Alex Cross series. Those are his adult series that I am interested in. And then he's got the Young Adult series of the Maximum Ride series and I'm also enjoying that one. I've read five books of that. The other two adult series, um, Alex Cross series and the Women's Murder Club, I have not started those. I am collecting them and I'm so close. I have almost all of them. So I'm just going to keep trying to get them and then um, start reading them. I could probably start reading them now because I know I've got the first few books of if each of those series. I don't know if he's quit writing the Alex Cross series or if he's still writing those. I'm not sure. But I want to get started on both of those series as well. Um, his contemporaries that I've read um, is Sunny's at Tiffany's, Sam's Letters to Jennifer, and um, Suzanne's diary for Nicholas I think it's called and all three of those were really were really decent my favorite was Sundays at Tiffany's though that was my most favorite of those he mostly writes mystery but he also has kind of a fantasy like book called the jester that was really really good yes fantasy I really enjoyed that one a lot I have read some of the single ones um, which I do believe are part of another series but I thought they were standalone and I read them but um, what I'm going to do now is show you the books that I have of James Patterson, and we will go from there. So, I didn't mention this first series right here. These are the Witch and Wizard series. So you got the first one here, it's Witch and Wizard. You got the Gift, you got the Fire, and then the Kiss. That is the four to that series. I don't know if there's going to be any more to that or not, but I read them all, and they were all really good. I enjoyed that series. Then the next ones we got here is the Max and Ride series, which starts with the Angel Experiment, School's Out Forever, Saving the World in Other Extreme Sports, The Final Warning, and then you got Fang, Angel, and then here we have Max, and then we've got Nevermore, which is the last one in that series. And then we've got the Alex Cross series. These are not in order, guys. I need to put them in order, but we've got... Um, Alex Cross, Double Cross, I Alex Cross, and Crossfire. Those four right there are for the Alex Cross series. Continuing over here with Cat and Mouse, Four Blind Mice, and you got Jack and Jill, London Bridges, The Big Bad Wolf, um, Violets Are Blue, Roses Are Red, Roses Are Red, Violets Are Blue, <laughs> um, Pop Goes the Weasel, Kiss the Girls, and Along Came a Spider. Then you got Alex Cross's Trial, Mary Mary, um, When the Wind Blows, The Midnight Club. Those two are not a part of the Alex Cross series. There's the Jester. And then we got the Women's Murder Club, which is First to Die, Second Chance, Third Degree, Fourth of July, The Fifth Horseman, The Sixth Target, Seventh Heaven, The Eighth Confession, The Ninth Judgment. And that's all that I have of the Women's Murder Club up to the number nine. So hopefully I can get the rest of those. I think it's up to thir I think there's 13 all together. I'm not for sure on that though. Um, and then for the contemporaries, we've got here um, Suzanne's Diary for Nicholas. And then we've got Sam's Letters to Jennifer. And the last one is Sundays at Tiffany's. And those are all his contemporary novels. I'm sure he's probably got more than that. I really like his contemporary um, books. I think he does a really good job on those. James Patterson books I have. Um, I want to get all those read. Um, if you have read James Patterson, let me know in the comments below. Let me know if you like him, what you don't like, what you do like. Um, and we will talk about it. Thanks, guys, for staying tuned, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.